Ladies and gentlemen, the special award for young business leaders goes to Rajiv Bajaj, Managing Director of Bajaj Auto, and Aditya Ghosh, President of Indigo. Please welcome on stage the young business leaders. Many, many congratulations to both of you for the award and Rajiv, particularly for the launch of the RE60. But what intrigues many of us is, why do you refuse to call it a car? Well, everybody needs a marketing position. And uh, <clears throat> the sharper your position, the less money you spend advertising. <laughs> right. And uh, so we position ourselves as an anti-car company. We think cars are too big, too expensive, too not green, too dangerous, too not happening. <laughs> Right. And uh, we believe in the three-wheeler, and we think that the four-wheeler is a natural evolution of the three-wheeler. So it's an auto on four wheels? Is that a correct description, or you wouldn't be happy with that too? No, I just call it a four-wheeler. Um, this is the 50th year of making the three-wheeler. We think it serves a large section of society admirably, uh, has done so for the last 50 years, and I hope that the four-wheeler will do that for the next 50 years. It's not a competitor to the Nano. What's that? <laughs> I like that. All right, Rajiv, very quickly before I also uh, get an insight into the aviation sector from Aditya, I remember interviewing both you and your father two years ago when he had actually said that he's very disappointed and hurt that you have decided to exit the scooters business. At a time when this segment is picking up again, do you regret your decision? You know, I think the most important thing in business is to have a sharp focus. As markets get competitive, you have to specialize. We have only 10% global market share in motorcycles. And uh, my team and I would like to see Bajaj be one Indian company that can dominate the world at least in one category. So we give our every minute and put our every rupee into the task of making our motorcycles world leaders across continents. We are getting there, and at this time, it would be fatal to distract our attention. So I think we will stick with that. All right, sticking with that, and let me move on to Aditya now. Aditya, clearly, we've got the aviation sector that's bleeding and bleeding badly. Yet, Indigo manages to churn out profit year after year. What's your recipe for success? Well, I think one, Shweta, um, I think it's, it's a myth that the entire sector does badly. So, you know, um, before, uh, before, you know, as an, as an airline CEO, we have a birthright to complain about everything. So uh, I think it's time that we introspect and look inside as well. And therefore, you know, for, um, you know, it happens all around the world that you know, the airline industry as a whole may not do well and there are few players who do better. So no, no recipe for, for success as such, but just trying to keep uh, focus on small little things and the small details and that's what makes it tick. Okay, let me ask that differently. What's your advice to the big boys of Indian aviation who are struggling right now? Uh, you know, uh, I may be young, I'm not foolish. <laughs> so, <laughs> but you have so, to answer that one. Um, there no, are enough, enough in the aviation sector who are struggling to stay afloat right now. But You've I, got to give them some <laughs> advice. I, I, think, I think, you know, uh, big is not always great. And um, I think uh, just, just moving gradually and, and, uh, and, and ensuring that we meet what the customers need, that's really what, what makes us stick. Makes us Dr. Roy. Okay, just a, uh, just a quick question. Bajaj family has been known to many of us from a different generation to you. I just wanted to know what it's like to uh, keep up with... It. You've got a really hard act to follow. Well, um, I, I believe in differentiation. I've tried to differentiate myself. I am the first mechanic in the family. Um, in all the engineering businesses put together, uh, they are all commerce and business graduates. I started with engineering. I'd like to stick with that. 
Um, I'd like to think of ourselves as a company that can be like an Apple one day and can create new categories and innovate all the time. So hopefully if I can continue to apply myself to that, uh, I'll be happy with that. Maybe he has a question. No, Mr. Bajaj, I believe you have a question for your son. Uh, he you always has a question for me. <laughs> He's saying he always... Now, I wouldn't dare ask uh, my son Rajiv a question, but I have a request for him. A couple of weeks ago at the Forbes function, I wasn't present, and he received an award. And the uh, system there was different. The lady <laughs> would ask the award winner some question, and you had to answer on the spur of the moment. Now, I'm told by my family, a large number of whom were present, that he was asked, keeping in mind, something to the effect, keeping in mind what fa your father has told you, what would you advise your son? And he immediately answered, I'm told, that genes sometimes skip a generation, so my son is likely to be as aggressive as my father, so I will request him to take it easy on me. <laughs> and my request to him is, please take it easy on me. <laughs> this, is not, this is not entirely true. All I said was, I would not say anything to my son. I would not try to advise him. Because our family's tradition is that the son doesn't listen to the father. So what's the point? He's just following your footsteps. Thank you so much, Aditya and Rajiv, for joining us. Thank you very much. Please come. NDTV's Cricket app. Android and iPhone. Faster scorecard. Special analysis and much more. Download free. NDTV.com slash apps.